Hey guys, it's Albert and Muffin Group. In today's video, I would like to have a closer look on show height under feature in the B Builder. It might be very useful or even lifesaver in specific situations, and I would like to show you how it works based on a header where I have too many menu items and I would like to replace them with mobile menu under specific breakpoint. Let's move on to my screen then. Alright, so what you basically see on my screen right now is the custom header that came with one of the pre-built websites and was built with the header builder tool, which is built in into Beefing. By the way, if you didn't have any chance to watch my tutorial where I shown how to create a custom header using header builder tool, I will leave you the link to the tutorial in the left top corner, but also down there in the description so you can watch it anytime you like. Alright, so let's focus on the option show height under I would like to show you based on the header in this case. Alright, so what I would like to show you is to hide the header you see right now in the B Builder. Uh, I mean the menu where we have items like about, menu, gallery, reviews and contact under specific breakpoint, but show under this specific breakpoint the mobile menu burger. All right, so let's maybe switch the front end uh, to visualize what I'm going to show you. Let me switch to the developer mode so you can see what I mean. Right, so uh, on the top, just here, you see the specific breakpoints. Uh, so when I start decreasing them, you're going to see that under specific breakpoint, the menu just breaks into two lines. And this is something I would like to avoid. I say don't like how it looks like. And in that case, the show height under menu option comes in handy. So to hide this menu, the regular menu, under specific breakpoint, let's just switch to the B Builder where I have my custom header. Let's select the menu element and under advanced responsive tab, we have an option called custom visibility. And because I would like this menu to hide under specific breakpoint, I have to select hide under and type the value under which I would like to hide this menu. In my case, it's 1320 pixels. All right, let's update the page right now and let's switch to the front end. Now, if I will refresh the page, you're gonna see that the menu will just disappear. And that's because we are in the breakpoint 1292 pixels right now, and it's under the value I set. So now if I will start increasing uh, the width of my window, you're gonna see that above 1320, the regular menu will just appear. And that's basically what I wanted to show you. But as you probably saw, there is the menu burger right now next to the menu, which is supposed to show only under specific breakpoint. And not all the time, like it just happens right now. So what I have to do is go to the builder right now, select this, sorry, select this menu burger element, which is the mobile menu icon, and other advanced responsive tab, I have to select show under and type the same value as I typed for the regular menu. And now as soon as I will update this page and we'll get back to the front end and we'll refresh this page again, you're gonna see that all I see right now is the regular menu and there is no menu burger icon, but as soon as I will start decreasing uh, the breakpoint, you're gonna see that the menu regular just disappear, but the mobile menu appear instead. So as you can see, this option show height under is pretty useful and might be used in specific cases, just the way you like, or you just need for a specific project. There is one more thing worth to be mentioned, and I just forgot to tell you, uh, because in the B Builder, you're gonna see uh, all elements you used. So as you see right now, we see the mobile menu and we see the regular menu. So you know what's where 
and it's just to make it clear for you and the people you work with what we exactly put in the header, what elements. So here we have all elements, but in the front end, we see only those elements we just need for a specific breakpoint. But if you or the person you're working with on the side or maybe your client just wonder what's happening with specific elements, as soon as we will refresh the B Builder with our header. After setting up this custom breakpoints for the regular menu and mobile menu, as soon as you hover over them, you're gonna see that extra tooltip, which when I hover over regular menu says height under 1320 pixels. And it basically tells you that this regular menu height under a specific breakpoint. And if I will hover over the menu uh, icon, you're gonna see the tooltip that says show under 1320 pixels. So it's just a really useful option that tells you something extra about the elements you used on the site. I really hope that this is clear and from now on you'd be able to create much more interesting projects and just show and hide specific elements in specific cases just the way you like. It's also worth to be mentioned that this advanced responsive tab with the custom visibility is available for all elements in the B Builder. So you are not limited with the elements in the header builder, but also anywhere on the site where you're just working on with specific elements. I really hope you like this video and I shed some light on how you can use this feature in your projects. As like said, it's pretty awesome option that many of you may didn't even knew about. So if you like this video, I encourage you to watch another video where I spoken about responsive editing in the B Builder. And as always, thanks for watching and remember to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified every time we release a new video. And if you have more questions, please visit our support center at support.muffingroup.com.